What's going on? It's Mike. I'm back again with another video. Today I'm going to do a comparison video on some leather cleaner and leather cream that you can use inside your vehicle for detailing. The three products I'm going to display today is from Garrett's Garage Leather 3 in 1 Spray. That is their cleaner. You can use it on RVs, homes, boats, personal leather items. You can use it on a lot of things. This, it's a pretty thick cleaner spray. It's a got a genuine leather scent to it. It actually smells pretty good. Uh, it's going to be matched up with the leather 3-in-1 clean. It cleans, conditions, protects. It's got UV protection for UV damage. That's going to go up against the uh, chemical guys combination of the leather cleaner with the leather protectant and serum, which also has advanced UV blocking agents with essential oils. This actually smells pretty good as well. Also going to go up against Adam's Polish leather interior cleaner with the leather interior dressing. We're going to see how that matches up with one another. The I was going to have uh, Ethos in this one. The only downfall with this one, which this is a very good product, is it's discontinued. So that one's going to stay out of the uh, video. If you like watching detailing videos, product reviews, and how-to videos? Please hit that subscribe button down below. In the meantime, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. All right, first product I'm gonna use is the Garage Garage Leather 3-in-1 Cleaner. It's actually some pretty good stuff. I've used it before on some other vehicles to clean up. I just use the proper detail brushes they're phenomenal if you've never used them I highly recommend them they are great brushes to use they're great for interior and exterior I got the black ones for the outside they just came out with the white ones I use them on the inside they're pretty good so this gear us garage 3 in 1 leather cleaner it's the fastest way to clean and beautify and protect all auto boat RV home and personal leather items it's got UV protection, smells just like leather. It's actually pretty good stuff. It's good on perforated seats. Just spray it right on there. Use my brush, clean up. Pretty good stuff. Then I'm just gonna take a towel and wipe it off. Like I said, the smell on here is phenomenal. It smells just like leather. So if you ever work on clean on perforated seats and you clean up your seats and you go through these little holes and you find some of them still got some debris or something in there, just use a toothpick. Toothpicks work out pretty good. They'll get everything out for you. This one's not too bad. Of course, hard, get, hard everybody sits in my back seat. Pretty clean. All right, so what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna take a fresh pad. I'm gonna get some leather. It's a three-in-one by Gear's Garage. Shake it up real good. I like their tops. The top's pretty good. Just pop, push it up. Put a little bit on. Push it down. I like that. It's pretty good stuff. Just gonna swish it around here a little bit and then just massage it in the leather mm, it smells good do this up in here on top of my other seats real quick all right so we got that one done. So I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna take my rag that I just had, flip it around. I don't like the shine, so if you take a rag and wipe off the excess, you get your matte finish. It's some pretty good stuff. It smells really good. Works really good. Next one I'm gonna show you is the Chemical Guys. All right, Chemical Guys, slightly different. It is similar. 
The only thing that's slightly different is they do have actually a leather conditioner that you can put on after their spray, but their leather serum is a whole lot better. So I'm just gonna spray their leather cleaner on there. It's clear. I'm just gonna use my uh, proper detail brush. Like I said, I got the black ones for outside, the white ones for inside. For me, it's easy to remember. So here's one thing I noticed different between the Gearats Garage and the Chemical Guys. Is on the Chemical Guys, it foams up. Some people do like the foam in action because you can actually see what you're picking up, which I do too. I like seeing it. I like seeing the foam. The Gearats Garage is a little bit thicker, so it's it's not gonna foam up. It's it's pretty thick. All right. So I got their spray down. Got the leather all cleaned up. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use their serum. I'm gonna use the applicator pad. I'm just gonna use the other side because I haven't used it yet. Put a little bit of their serum on there. And I'm just gonna massage it in. Like so. Got a uh, doesn't have a lemon. I mean, doesn't have a leather smell. It has. Let me see what this smells like. Let me see. Hmm. Yeah, I guess it could. I mean, it's very, very faint. Yeah, it's kind of a neutral smell. So, this one here, the serum. Also, let me see if this one also has a UV protection. It does also have a UV protection, so the Gear Art Garage has one. The Chemical Guys has one. Next one we're going to show is the Adams Polish. We'll show that one next. All right. Let's see. All right. Next one we're going to do is the Adams Polish. It's a leather and interior dressing. And they have a cleaner. This one says it's a matte finish and odorless. We're going to find out. Uh, I do not see a UV blocker on the dressing, but doesn't have any UV blocker on this one, but we're going to find out how it works though. Hmm, got a distinct the spray has a little smell to it. It's not too bad. All right, let's see if it really does have a matte finish. We're about to find out. Put a little bit on. And massage it in. All right, that's about it. I'm gonna take you back inside and give you my final thoughts. Okay, I'm back with my final thoughts. Thanks for watching so far. Third place, which is my least favorite, would be the Adams Polish leather and interior cleaner and dressing. I didn't find it as it worked as good as I would expect it. Though it did do the job, it does have a matte finish, no scent. Second place, which is uh, which I was talking about earlier when they had the 
Chemical Guys has their conditioner, but I believe their serum is, is actually a little bit better. Second place, you can get this at AutoZone. You can get these at Walmart, the leather cleaner and the conditioner. Get, uh, you can get the leather protectant and serum at the, the detail garage or at chemicalguys.com. Links will be in the description down below. Uh, this is a very good one-two punch right here. I do like the cleaner because it does fuzz up quite a bit. I, I like that. Uh, this has a very good scent to it. It's workable. Has good matte finish, good UV protection, which I like a lot. For your bang for your buck, you can get an AutoZone. The only place I can find it so far, the Gearhouse Garage, leather three in one spray and the conditioner with the leather scent with the cleaning leather vehicles uh, couldn't beat it uh, the gear S garage products are pretty good it's a uh, up against ethos would be pretty tough to, to for them to go up head to head with one another we are going to do some gear S garage versus ethos products here pretty soon um, so Check the links down below. I'll have everything in the descriptions down there for you to check out. Like, like I say, if you like watching detailing videos, product reviews, mystery box openings, how-to products, please hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.